Hi, my name is Brian from Denmark, your tech friend, and in this video I'll show you the Google Pixel 3a Android 12 update. And I'll just show you in comparison the Google Pixel 6. So you just can compare the sizes of these two phones. If you are thinking about upgrading, please watch my other video on the Google Pixel 6 up here. Well, let's talk about the Google Pixel 3a. This is a little beauty of a phone and at its time, only two years ago actually, released in 2019, this was a brilliant camera phone. It's very lightweight and it had all of Google's, um, well, uh, features built into it and it's a very snappy phone actually, though it's a, it's a tiny processor, not a super quick processor. So I kind of like this phone a lot. Uh, I really like the small form factor, but let's just have a look at that Android 12 on this phone. Okay, so just aligned it with the Pixel 6 and you can see its dimensions against the Pixel 6. As you can tell now, you can also get always on display. And then if you scroll down, you have these new menu icons. Camera access or deny and mic access or deny. And you have them in these kind of scrolling yeah, I can switch is just a design principle nightmare. I don't know who was in charge of that. Then the camera has a new setup as you probably already experienced if you own one. And that is that you now have all these times um, zoom you can choose from instead of uh, beforehand where you had this kind of, um, especially on the Samsung phones, you had these uh, single person or two persons indicating you would want to use a wide or an ultra wide but this is how the new camera setup looks like and then if you head down into options you can see they're exactly the same on both phones and it has this kind of you can rubbery feel to it if you just press it up there but it's exactly the same but if you go into settings and you go into about about the phone and you press the Android version number, then you get this Easter egg function. That's what they call it. Press it a lot of times, and then you can actually turn this down. And if you set it to 12, ta da, you get this background. You can, you can um, make a screenshot of and use as your new background on your phone if you like. And you can choose different widgets, and of course, the clock, you can choose different. Uh, templates of themes and that too. And then the last thing I'm actually going to show you is how you can adjust the background on these phones. You can choose these background colors and then we'll take some of the background colors of the current background you're actually using to like implement that in your icon sets up also. Or you can use these fundamental colors and then we'll just turn them into what Google and Pixel have predefined. I actually like these kind of green, or green ones. And then you can choose if you want the theme icons or not. You can see here on the Pixel 3a and I've chosen like not to have those theme icons on the Pixel 6. And those are the main new features in Android 12 that you can visually see. Hope you like the content of this video. My name is Brian from Denmark, your tech fan. Please do remember to press like, comment and subscribe. And I'll see you in the next one.